Check. Hi. I'm on my match in the dark. 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 Coming up next, it's a UFC featherweight division fight. No denying this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing to He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kick. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he eyes very well as he follows with a jab right hand, left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it. He will try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. This is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape now for this featherweight fight. So two years, the gap in age with similar height and some differences in reach. And once again, here is the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buck. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 143 pounds. Fighting out of Portland, Oregon, Bazooka. And now with the losing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. Ready. Tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. Oh, and now he lands the knee. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. Didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing. He doesn't have any kills in his Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Nice punch, Lance. And he caught the kick. Ooh, head kick, Lance. He's hurt. It ain't 
to Kembe Mutombo, but he is blocking all these shots coming Man, this way. Man, get that out of here. He sees it coming. You're going to have to mix it up. Shake that finger. Shake that finger. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. And both guys really throwing with authority. <laughs> Trying to kick the leg out. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Three minutes and counting to go here in round one. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Powerful leg kick land. the jab now no good and he landed the right hand there oh he's got that right hand going tonight DC connected with it there he's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe it's unreal oh tagged him with that right hand what a strike that was what a strike that he is landing over and over again his opponent will need to make some adjustments Able to check the high kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail to take DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that jab. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Hook shot lands. He missed with that jab attempt there. His hands look good to me. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Twenty seconds to go in round one. Big kick land. Ten seconds to go. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round underway. Lee gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Oh, he lands a huge kick here. Right 
right hand on point. Nice kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, landing a punch with the left hand now, so certainly putting it all together on the feet tonight. He's doing a lot of work with his offhand. Looking to set up that head kick again. This one does not find the home. There you go, look for the shot. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Well, he's got the longer reach and certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now... Oh! Left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, man. You jumped out of your seat a little bit after that attempt. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. Once you get to take that many kicks, it doesn't matter if they're hard or not. Those are a lot of kicks. Look at him drive his shin into his own body with that body kick. Nice head kick. Lee's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Oh! Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, no! Oh, straight right! Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. That shot is blocked by Lee. Missed with that attempt. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Kick. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. That was landed clean. He's getting lit up right now, John. Final seconds here of round number two. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. And that's the end of round number two. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well. 
but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal. And if he can land, he does have the ability to damage it. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. Start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes, and a good sign too. Doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Unable to land the head kick there, and he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He landed that punch over and over again. What's he gonna do to follow up? Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Pretty significant welt to the left side. <laughs> Oh! Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Some fighters shy away from checking a light kick. Check that one. Oh, straight right! He's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Big kick lands. Oh, nice hook. That was a crippling shot right there. Threw it real tight. Elbow tight. Big check in it. Landed it right on the chin. Well, you can just see he is oozing with confidence and not overconfidence, but a big knockdown in round one likely the source of that confidence. When everything is going great, you tend to feel like you can walk through a wall. He doesn't need to walk through a wall. He needs to continue to find the right avenue to land those shots. What a punch. Ooh, we what a right hand by this young man. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. That was a thudding leg kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Ooh, big shot lands. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. And he comes through with a big knee. Another huge knee. He is on point tonight. Nice liver shot. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish this fight. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Oh, whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. Fifteen 
15 seconds to go. Back to the leg kick now, that one's no good. Right hook to the head block. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. He's hurt back. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Shot there. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick. And now he lands a combination. Oh, big left. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. All right, so he lands another punch there, and he smells blood in the water, going right back at that cut. Absolutely. The opponent has a lot of scar tissue around the eyes. He was able to cut it open, and now he's just touching it over and over again. This big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Big head kick lands. Connects with a right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Lands a right hand out of that exchange. Whiffs on that offering. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. There's no give on that leg kick. Good stick. Real sneaky body Just misses there with the left. Big head kick. Under two minutes now to go in the round. Lee going for the body, targeting that area with the kick, but unable to land. There with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Nice kick to the body. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Nice body kick right up the elbow.
final minute now of round four. Oh, head kick attempt. Head movement prevents it from landing. Under a minute to go in round four. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, big left hook there. Well, you gotta be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Lee is attempting to pass here, but he's denied by the defense. Nice hammer fist. He's putting him in exactly the positions he needs to be in right now. He's able to relax here. And he understands, being a veteran of so many fights, that as long as he's on top, he's winning. He feels like he's winning here. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing oh, in some body God. shots. There's the end of the round. We'll show you some of the highlights. It must feel pretty damn good to knock a man down like that. It feels good to knock a man down. And most times, you don't even feel it. It's the ones that you don't even recognize that landed hard are the ones that usually put your opponent out. It landed right on the sweet spot, and he hurt his opponent very badly. Ready to fight? Ready. Fifth and final round. Nice straight punch. Oh. He didn't like that left hand. He's got him hurt here. Oh! Lands a good combination. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Like that, the fight is over. He's done, he's done. <laughs> you knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment for that fighter tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at 31 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. All right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory.